Empirical provide compelling, interactive learning across a range of delivery options. Live on site, live online or online anytime, we have a training course that is ideal for you. For a no-obligations chat about your training requirements, contact us at empirical.com. The 4G radio access network is continually evolving through to additional enhancements referred to as LT Advanced and then on to LT Advanced Pro. Now with this you get various radio enhancements to optimize performance, latency, capacity. One of the key ones here is dual connectivity. This was added as part of LT Advanced. So what is dual connectivity? So here we have a mobile currently on a cell, and that cell is referred to as the master RAN node, the RAN there being the radio access network. What we're now saying is, yes, we can get all our services from that cell, but we need to think about how we potentially offload some of the traffic to that cell, but also give this subscriber a better level of service. And that's by introducing some small cells. Now, in this case, we have identified as a secondary RAN node. And the difference here is, rather than push the mobile towards this small RAN node, we're going to have dual connectivity. So what is that? Well, we're going to take the data, or some of the data, from the cell site, the master RAN node, and pass it on to this small cell. And this would be across the X2 interface on a 4G network, but this is equally applicable to 5G, where it would be the XN interface. And the data now arriving at that secondary RAN node can be scheduled to that mobile. So the mobile is effectively getting two streams, one from the master RAN node and one from the secondary RAN node. Now, putting this into more practical scenarios, so as a mobile is going through a micro cell, for example, the master RAN node, it can see these small cells, but rather than just switching to them, we're going to jump into dual connectivity. So you can see we're going to get boosted on that small cell. We're going to then switch to the next small cell and get another boost. We're then going to go back exclusively to the master RAN node, and then we're going to switch into a another small cell, another boost. And the key thing there is we're getting boosts of performance as we go to dual connectivity with those small cells. Need to know more? Why not visit our store where you can choose from over 200 hours of video-based training? Alternatively, you can contact us to discuss any specific training requirements you may have.